you know, now I live in Paris, it's kind of the city of fashion. Why can't I wear cool stuff anymore? So I decided it's time for me to put outfits together again to look cute. Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited, probably more excited than you about this video. I used to watch YouTube years ago, decades ago. I used to watch hauls and makeup tutorials and things like that. I was very into fashion back then. I was buying a lot of things. I was loving putting outfits together. I was just loving dressing because I don't dress anymore. <laughs> and with time, I kind of like drifted away from that and I became sort of a minimalist but no effort kind of person that wears leggings every day, you know. It's time for me to, to put outfits together again to look cute. I'm joking because I'm actually like super confident with a pajama and no makeup at all, you know me. But yeah, I'm just super excited. I feel like a real YouTuber. <laughs> um, okay, so I have seven brands mostly European brands because I live in France but I'm gonna try to see if they ship worldwide and I'm gonna put all the information in the description box uh, nothing is sponsored I'm just showing everything because I like the outfits I like the clothes in the next video I really want to talk about sustainability itself and slow fashion and fair fashion because I think it's such an important topic to talk about but today is just a haul so I'm just gonna show you the outfits the first brand that I want to talk to you about is called Thinking Mu or Thinking Mu. I don't really know how it's pronounced. They're from Spain, Barcelona, and the clothes are made in Portugal, so it's a very European brand. This top is from them. It has like a kind of U neck in the back. It's super light, and thank God because right now it's like 35 degrees already and it's not even 9 a.m. What I love about Thinking You is on their website, they are very, very, very specific on each item. This is organic cotton, this is a recycled material, we've made this with that. They know everything and it really adds value. You really know what you're purchasing and I think that's amazing. So this is made from hemp, a very sustainable plant. All the clothes came in this little bag to put like even dirty clothes when you're traveling or just clean clothes and you want to protect the fabric because sustainability is also about this is having durability in your clothing. I got a really nice loose t-shirt with surfers on top as a print because I'm from Tahiti and I just love surfing and I think it's really nice cut too like and it's we're getting cut in and the feel is really amazing and then I got two other items haven't really worn that before but I thought why not change it up this is a long skirt the print I really love it's little palm trees and it's like a washed out pink this top is from this is first based it's actually five years old I got it in Australia on sale I think it was five euros five dollars but this skirt it just stops on the right um, hey, on my ankle. I think it looks super cute. You can open it if you want to open it. <laughs> and I just think it's really nice for like a summer evening. And then you're gonna either love or hate it. I saw it online and I was like, ah, oh, this is so unique. This is like so unique, I want it. So it's a very long blues. I love the color, first of all, I think it matches kind of great with my eyes and my hair color. Of course you have to tie it, otherwise it just looks like nothing. You have to add a little belt and it's so light and so comfortable. The night I receive it, I put it on to try it and I was like not putting it off. It's seriously so comfortable. You can also wear it open. I just really am in love and I would love to know if you like it or you hate it. <laughs> I personally love it. Okay, let's talk bikinis. I got two pieces of swimwear by Tropic of Sea. Tropic of Sea is a sustainable brand 
by Candice Swenepoel. She's a top model. I love Candice. I think she's so, well, first of all, beautiful, but you can see that she's a beautiful person inside. She does so much for the environment. Gosh, she's just so cute. She actually followed me one and a half year ago, something like that, and the day she followed me, I was like, you, <laughs> you not only made my day, you made my whole year. Anyways, I love her and I wanted to try her brand. Those are very expensive bikinis. They're not like cheap, so don't come at me in the comments saying like it's not an affordable option. I know it's not affordable. I died inside <laughs> when I purchased them. They're both from C Collection. I honestly don't feel super comfortable putting myself in a bikini on YouTube, but when I purchase the bikini I really wish that someone would show a try on that's not on a top model or that's not on a model that's just on a normal person to know how it looks like so I'm gonna do it but I kind of feel uncomfortable doing it so please be kind in the comments you can definitely tell that it's very luxurious fabric they're made from eco nylon so it's like nylon but it's made from waste recycled waste so nice to think that you're wearing a bikini that's actually saving the ocean too both of the tops have a very straight line i think it's flattering if you have small boobs i'm not sure if you have bigger boobs how it would look like the bottoms are very revealing for both it's basically a thong for the two pieces and it's also pretty much a thong for the one piece I absolutely love the color and I feel like this e can even be worn with a jean just two things I did not like already with the brand is the sizing first of all I mean I'm short I'm not a model but I'm not like big either the bikinis are small they do have extra small so I was like should I take an extra small should I take a small because I usually am in between the two and even the small is small if I were to order again I would probably take a medium but I didn't want to exchange because I had to pay twice the shipping and twice the taxes and the taxes were really expensive and that's another thing that I did not like about the brand is that I got them on sale and they did not put the right amount on the paper to hand to DHL and so I had like the full amount to pay on taxes and I wrote to them they did not want to change that so I was like you know that hurts Moving on to organic basic, they use recycled material and they're doing very, very basic things. And I think that's so great because I need a lot of basics in my everyday life, especially when I'm teaching yoga, for example, and I need like very plain tops and underwear and things like that. And that's what they do. So I got underwear, I got the thong and it's actually pretty, pretty sexy, to be honest. I got their bra i love the color it's like a bald very nice and very nice feel too the bra is reversible so it's either saying basically better made or it just says organic basic quality pieces you know i also got this tank top which is a black very simple again tank top i got it in size small it's the same fabric from the underwear when you're working out or even just like a little sleek look with a jean i like it you can also fold it to do a crop top because it's so thin you can't even see that you folded it and finally i got a white tee again size small i think i could have gone for size medium because it's a bit small at my shoulders i have wider shoulders so maybe i should have taken medium but it seriously fits so well and it's so nice to feel on your skin you definitely feel that it's an organic fabric um, and that it will last i'm super stoked the pieces are not super cheap but if you think of how many times you're going to buy a basic piece from let's say H&M or Zara, things that I used to do. If you add it up, you will save money eventually if you buy from organic basic for sure because you can see that the material is going to stay forever. So maybe not forever, but a long, long time. And also you're doing so good for the environment. Organic Basic actually reached out to me a couple of months ago and I wasn't really interested into sustainable fashion. But now that I am, I actually reached out to them again and saying like, actually, I would be ready to work with you. So I am an affiliate for them. It means that if you discover the brand or if you like something and you want to purchase it and you do it through my link, I earn a little commission 
emotion out of it but it's just really nice because it's no extra cost for you and it actually supports my channel the next thing i bought are from vinted vinted is an app where you can thrift shop on i have my own store i sell clothes on there if you want to have a look i'll have the link in the description box below but i also buy things and i'm so happy about my purchases purchases let me show you what I got. I got two pair of jeans. They fit perfect on my body. I got a black and I got a white jean that has a hole at the knee and I'm so happy because I've never had a jean like this before. So that's a steal. We love it. I also got this very nice linen blues and I think it looks amazing open or close with a jean with a short with a skirt and linen is perfect for summer i think this is a really good outfit if you're going if you're working on an, in an office like casual but kind of chic you know and finally i got something that's really not for summer <laughs> you always buy that sweater in summer don't you but come on come on j'adore <laughs> Come on, how gorgeous is the color and the cut and everything of this sweater. I think it was only like 12 euros that I paid and honestly, I'm so happy about it. Can't wait to wear it. I think this has wool inside, so it's not a vegan, but I don't mind buying second clothes that aren't vegan, second hand clothes. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy about it. Next, I got super cute slippers from Avuri, which is a German brand and they're super ethical and sustainable in the way they work. They know exactly where each item has been done and even like who made it or they know how long it took. So on their, so it comes in a little bag and on the tag here, you have how many hours it's taken to make. And so those have taken five hours to be made. They're giving a part of their revenues to education. I absolutely love these, like they look so cute. It's real raffia and they look so cute with dresses or like jeans. I think they look super summery. I saw them first on Chloe Kian. The only thing I'm really not sure, unfortunately, if the sole is not leather. I received them and I was like, It smells like leather, but I went onto the website. I could not find any information about the sole, so I'm not sure if it's leather or not. In depth, I'm not gonna say they're vegan because I don't want you to think they're vegan if you're vegan and you want to buy them. Something I'm kind of like, ugh. Staying on the shoe theme, I got these super pretty sandals. I mean, they are so gorgeous. They come from Zoa Store which is an online place where you can buy luxury items. So the things there aren't cheap, but they're very well made and it's a sustainable production. I absolutely loved those sandals. It looks so cute. The color is perfect. It makes my legs look taller because I'm very short. So it's perfect for me. They're really comfortable and they're like very tall. I think it's 12 centimeter heel. I think they really make like, any summer outfit really chic but also casual you know what I mean so I love them my final purchase come from Cezanne you may know that brand it's a French brand they're not 100% sustainable yet so you need to kind of look where each item has been done if you really want to buy something very sustainable I'm gonna show you three things that I got you may not know but I'm a very summer dress person I absolutely love a really cute dress and this is a really cute dress so damn cute ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> I got this skirt which on the website look really nice. And then I got it and I was like, I'm not sure. And it was a bit big. So I shipped it back and I got it on size 34 and it fits really better. And it just looks better and cuter and also shorter my legs. I need something really above the knee. Kind of chic, like on a Sunday brunch or something or at night. 
It's not like an everyday thing. I don't think you can do a lot of activity in this. Of course, it's a skirt. And finally, this is one of my favorite pieces. Again, you might love it, you might hate it. <laughs> it's a jumpsuit! It's like a t-shirt cut. I think it's in Lyocell. I'm not sure about this now. Yeah, it is. So it's a very sustainable fabric. I took size 34 and I could have gone for 36 but at the same time I feel like I'm a 34 body but some parts are a bit tight like here it's not really pretty I need to put the pocket down and to put that up and I also need to like shorten it a bit I think it fits really well with those shoes but here would be cuter because my ankle up here appears um, thinner it feels very light on the skin. So happy about this purchase and it feels so soft and good and yeah, I'm just I'm just really happy. <laughs> That's it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed this haul. Okay, I'm a newbie, I'm a beginner, so maybe it wasn't a great video, but I'm gonna get better. I really want to start talk more about sustainability, like I said at the start. I don't know if you would be interested, please let me know in the comments below. Let me know actually where you're going, if you're going somewhere this summer. I'm going to Corsica with my sister and my mom, and I really can't wait to be on holidays. Yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Leave it a little thumbs up if you did. Also, if you're not already, I would love to have you on my channel, so don't forget to subscribe. There's a little button for it. It's not here for nothing. <laughs> and it's free for you, and it would make me really happy, and now the noise is starting again outside. All right, I hope you have a beautiful day, and I'll see you soon on my channel.